Hi, this is Phil here, and today I'm going to show you how to set a custom white balance using a grey card within Adobe Photoshop and Camera Raw. So for this I'm using uh, Photoshop CS6 and Camera Raw 7.3. So starting off, open your image and it will pop up in Camera Raw like this and you will see a panel to the right hand side. Now the part we're focusing on is this part here, the white balance. So the white balance is really just how you represent colours and how cold or warm they look. And what we're wanting to do is we're wanting to make sure that the colours are represented correctly. So as you can see the slider here allows you to adjust the white balance and it'll adjust the, the way the colours are represented on your screen. Um, so you can move it to the far left and your model looks like a smurf. And you move it to the far right and it looks like your model spent too much time on a sunbed. So what you wanted to do is to set the white balance uh, as correctly as possible. I, the easiest way i found is to use a grey card, so I take a test shot with the model uh, using one of these things. Uh, I'll put a link in uh, my YouTube channel so you can get one if you want. Um, the easiest way i found is to use the white balance tool, which is this third icon up here on the left hand side. You can also press I to get there quickly. And click on the, on the grey card and it will set a custom white balance and adjust the slider for you like that. And then once you've done that, your colours are represented as correctly as possible. So if you are printing off photos, you'll find that the skin looks more natural. So hopefully that's helpful for you. Um, if there's any questions, drop them into my uh, stream. Thanks.